Hey guys, it's Andrew here with Cyber Review. Welcome back. Today I have a review for you on a brand new app called Display Recorder. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Alright guys, so what Display Recorder allows you to do is it allows you to record your iPhone, your iPod Touch, and your iPad screen in real time. Now this is a first for the App Store. The only way you were able to do this before is if you had a jailbroken device and used the app from the Cydia Store. Uh, but for some reason, Apple allowed this third party app into their App Store and you can use it and it works. So uh, it could get pulled in the future, but for now it's working and it works pretty good. So when you first open the app, this is what the screen will look like. It has a basic layout, record, your timer, your stop button, and then down at the bottom it has four tabs for different areas. The first tab is for your recorded items that you may have recorded, and this is where they will be stored. All right guys, so the next tab you have is your settings tab, and there are a lot of settings. I was really surprised. Uh, the first one is you can choose your record type. You can do audio, video, or both together. Then you also have your max time you can set for a certain uh, time to record. And then there's a whole bunch of other ones, video quality, video size, screen orientation, and a whole bunch of others. I'm not gonna go over all of them, but there is a lot here to choose from. And the final tab you have is your help tab. It basically just tells you how to use the app and what it's compatible with. So now I wanna show you guys how this works. So it's really simple, you just hit the record button, and as you can see, the timer's running there, so you just hit the home button to go back to your home screen, and there you go, up at the top it says display recording, and it's recording right now. So you just kinda do your thing, you can talk if you have the audio going, and it just records. Now, it does record in MP4, so it's really nice, easy to transfer to your computer and other devices you may wanna transfer it to. It also will directly import to YouTube if you wanna do that, you can do that as well. Now when you're done recording, you just go back into the app and hit the stop button, and it'll go ahead and merge the audio and video tracks if you have chosen that option. So once it's done merging, you just go into your recorded items. You have all of your items you've recorded in there. You can just go ahead and click on whatever one you want to preview it. You can also, like I said, export it to another device, or you can upload it to YouTube. All right guys, so here is the test of Display Recorder. I just wanted to show you guys what it sounds and what it looks like when you are recording directly from your phone. Now, uh, nothing here uh, I have voiced over or done any special test right from the iPhone. This is what you're gonna get when you're recording it. Now, one thing I have noticed is you guys are probably seeing, I just clicked on the Nook, and as you can see, it's, it's very laggy, and down at the bottom there, that Barnes & Noble's cut off. And I've been having this problem on my phone. I don't know if it happens with everybody's phone or if it's just been mine, but as you can see, it's taken a really long time to load. So this has been a problem I've had when using it. Um, it's kind of off and on. Sometimes it'll work just fine. Sometimes it'll take a long time to load like this. So anyway, that's something to bear in mind when you guys are using it. But, uh, I mean, for the most part, it works okay. They do note that it does have bugs uh, when you do purchase it. So that could be uh, an issue there, just to bear in mind. All right, guys. So for that test, everything you heard, like I said, was right from the phone. Even those portions where the audio all of a sudden cut out, that was from the app, and that's just how it happened. So anyway, that was just to give you guys a really good idea of how it does work. All right, guys, well, that does it for my review of Display Recorder. If you guys think you might want to pick this up, it is $1.99 in the App Store. Thanks for watching, guys. If you liked the video, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to see more upcoming videos, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.